There we are. Hey yeah, guys, this is Dead Linux, and we are. I'm just trying to see if there's any incriminating data. Oh, you can see my name, I guess. Um, hopefully, you didn't see my server name, and even if you did, well, screw it. Um, welcome to Linux. This is Linux, and this is the Technic Launcher. So we are actually downloading and installing um, something I just saw off of the Augscast. Um, or a link in the Yogg's Cast's videos. If you haven't checked out the Yogg's Cast in a while, now's a good time to do it. <clears throat> but this is the the Technic Launcher. Now, the Technic Launcher is a modified launcher for Minecraft that allows you, evidently, now this is me just doing this five minutes ago, to install the Technic Pack, the Yogg Box, the Voxel Mod Pack, which I don't even know what that is, or Hack Slash Mine. I've seen the videos for it, by the Augscast. Uh, I don't know if I'd want to try it, but then I thought, well, this launch includes everything. Because the Technic pack, as you may have known, is that wonderful pack of various mods that I like to use along with um, Direwolf20. He, l he loves the mods. He doesn't use the Technic pack. He installs them vanilla, and I do the same thing because I have a lot better luck that way, but I thought, you know what, it's the, it's the Augscast doing this, they did a really good job with the Augbox, so I thought, why not give it a try? But I wanted to just show you installing it, I don't think I'll be able to play it very well. Oh, see, and there we go, there's open joke, oh, maybe it'll be okay. Um, but this will be laggy, because I'm using a, a program called Record My Desktop, and I, it does well recording desktop functions, it does not do well with OpenGL accelerated stuff. So I just wanted to put this out really quickly, excuse me, um, to show you the, the, the mod pack, to show you the installer, to show you the page where you can get it. Um, you'll see here it's the, the technicpack.net, um, technic pack with a, with a CK at the end, uh, so keep that in mind. Um, and here we are, it actually loaded. And this is on Linux. And by the way, this is OpenSUSE uh, 12.1. Um, here, let me um, see if I can do this. Uh, let's see. I'm using KDE. Oh, you see my name on my computer? No, no, you'll try and find it on the internet. Um, well, that didn't help at all. It used to be a sysinfo function for KDE. Guess it's not there anymore. Um, Oh, wait a minute, maybe it's in, uh, where's Conqueror, Conqueror, there it is. Um, I just kind of want to show you my, uh, would you like to, refer no, do not restore, total halibut, of course it is, love the guy. Do not restore, just open Conqueror. Here we go. Um, oh, I hope this still works, used to. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Hallelujah. Okay, so what we're doing is, uh, oh, here you go. At least it doesn't have my IP address out here anywhere. Um, I may, and I may have to edit that out later. Uh, maybe I will, maybe I won't. You're not going to know what that means anyway. And there's a nice plane flying over it, so that's fun. OpenSUSE 12.1. I'm using the 64-bit edition, and we're using KDE 4.72. I'm also using uh, ATI's card and the FGLRX driver. Um, and I got 4 gigs of memory and all this other crap. So that's the system I'm running on it. I didn't show you the OpenGL version. Oh, the Java version. Um, hang on. I think I can show you. So if I do this, we do Java version. Oh! Come on. Oh, come on. Don't let me down. Help. If I could type. There we go. Okay. Ah, there. Oh, jeez, you can't even see that. Bing, bam, boom. I'm using the OpenJDK, and it's running in it. So, and I've done this before. I've run Linux with the OpenJDK runtime. It's good. It's not a bad thing to try. If you're in Linux and you're playing Minecraft and everybody says, you should have the Oracle version of Java. You should always use Sun Java. Sun Java is no more, people. Oracle's Java is what exists now. And OpenJDK is based in Sun Java, and they're still updating it. If you have compatibility problems, I recommend trying Open Java first. Um, if you have performance issues at that point, then switch to Oracle. 
Um, we're going to see if I can get in here. This video is going to get really bad really quickly, but um, we're at least going to try and create a world quick. But I'm just saying, uh, don't be afraid to try it. Because if it works for you, wonderful. And it's open source, and it, I always think it's really stable because it's in the repositories and people are working on it. Um, there we go. Let's just do that. I'll run it in a small window so you can see the background. And we'll see how it works. Switching level. That's new. Okay. Yes, I am renaming my computer after this, so don't even try me. Don't even try me. Also, this computer is not available on the internet anyway, so. Let's see. Okay, this is where it's going to start getting laggy. And as it does that, I'm going to close it out and then we'll. Uh, See if I can upload this. Ooh, hello. Can't see. Oh my god, there's a lot of stuff here. You have not started the creation quest. Press C for Oh, and they're using Millionaire Matmos. Oh my dear lord. I pressed E to open my inventory. Oh no, and they have too many items installed. I don't like that. Great. Ooh. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. There's red power. Right there. There's the trees. Oh, and the sound is amazing. You probably can't hear this because Record My Desktop doesn't capture sound properly right now. Um, I will be using GLC um, to try and capture more Linux stuff. Uh, I don't know if you guys want to see it. I don't know if anybody would want to see this stuff. But um, it's pretty cool. I enjoy it. And I intend to post more videos on this stuff anyway, because people need to see this. But anyway, there you go. So there's, there is a successful Linux install of the uh, Yogscast um, Technic Launcher installing the Technic Pack. How simple is that? All the mods? And uh, just to make sure, we have a uh, build craft. We have to do one sacred, sacred, sacred test. And the test is create a gear in build craft. Um, because, you know, if you can create a build craft gear, then you know life's going to be better for you. So let's do this. I am not using that dang window. Uh, all right. We need to, oh, oh no, 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 no. Oh, not this. Oh, I hate this. This is. Uh, oh, what's the what's the clicking? It's. Uh, it's not red power. It's another mod, and I can't remember which mod it is. But we got to do this, and this, and that. Get a bunch of sticks. Okay. Throw that sucker down. Here's the test. Let's see. We'll see if it. What the heck is that noise? Hear all these birds. Okay, success. We have gears, so we know it installed properly for build craft. Don't know about industrial craft. Oh yeah, we do. We do. We do know about industrial craft. I just need a little bit more wood here. People are walking by outside. It's a nice day outside. Um, although you can't really tell because all I can hear are Minecraft noises. All right, do this, do that. Let's see if I can remember the recipe for an extractor. And I can't. Failed. Come on, come on. Come on, don't hate. Extractor. Okay, we have both of them. Buildcraft and industrial craft, both installed in a snap, like that. So this is good stuff. So again, this is Dead Linux coming along. Uh, thanks for being here, and give it a try. Technic Pack. Uh, www.technicpack with a ck.net and uh, give it a try. Enjoy it. It'll take the stress out of installing these mods. So, thank you so much, and we'll talk to you later. Bye bye.